the request of the Office of Civil Defense. A massive nuclear attack is currently taking place against the United States. NORAD military radar detected the launch of 400 nuclear missiles. Hello and welcome back to Fallout 4. So I've got one thing to turn in here and then I figured we'd take on some more of these railroad missions. But I didn't realize that when Nordhagen Beach a few episodes ago wanted me to go do uh, Taffington Boathouse that it was Mercer's safe house for the railroad. So I finished that. Human machine interface to 100%. Good evening, agent. My data indicates Mercer's safe house has been established. Reward dispensed. Further help is required. I have the location of a Black Ops cache. It contains supplies our organization needs. Railroad Alpha has asked for you to secure the cache from any hostels in its vicinity. Tell me about the mission. The cache is hidden in compliance with tactical counter surveillance protocols. This RFID device will locate and unlock the cache upon close proximity. Got it. Agent's assessment is correct. You only have to secure the cache. Runners will transport contents on a separate timetable. Terminating human machine interface. <laughs> All right, so we finally get the, uh, the DIA cache missions. So actually, Let's go do those, because after you finish those, you get, um, the, uh, Ballistic Weave, which is very nice, a uh, very nice thing to have. So, the easiest way to get here is gonna be, well, we can get there from the ground, we can get there from the bank, uh, or we can get there from the roof of the Mass Bay Medical Center. There's a few other ways, but, um... I'm just trying to think. I guess we can... I guess we can go there from... From Mass Bay. It's only gonna be a little further, but it's alright. So, of course, it had to get dark. Oh, wait a minute. That might help. Let's try that again. That was from uh, the last episode, uh, after I finished recording, I set up Abernathy Farm. That's why that was still on. So, I'm trying to think. I mean, I know that this runs under Mass Bay Medical, but now that I think about it, I don't know if there's actually a way up here. Uh, let's go down this way. And if I don't find anything, I'll, I'll cut until we find a way up. I think this way up is blocked. Just need to get on the overpass. Oh great. Well, we can try and jump. Oh, who didn't see that coming? Crap. Might have helped if I was running a little faster. Like sprinting. This is a, a little more of a convoluted way to actually get it to where I need to go here. But uh, just the way I want it to go. Oh, you're kidding me. Well, there's one other way to get on the overpass. Let's go over here. Gonna oh there this one will this one will work. I think I'm dusting Deacon, but that's alright. Don't know who's fighting down there, but it's not my problem at the moment. Guess it was early morning. Here comes the sun. Alright. Get there from here. 
I do need to get up one more level, but there should be a ramp past the medical center. Well, collapse piece of... Oh, now I gotta wait for the cell to load. That's nice. You made it. Really need to figure out what's doing that. I have no idea why this just started happening recently. It shouldn't be going on at all. See, it's not even rendered in. There we go. Like, when I first got this game on my old computer, that happened a lot. Oh, this is gonna get frustrating. I know it's probably not good for performance, but I really wish the entire world outside would just render in completely and just stay that way. Cause I get so tired of this crap. There we go. Oh, I don't want to step there. This is a really stupid, inconvenient problem to have. Come on, road. Hopefully I don't have to continue waiting on it to load as we keep going. Oh, where the hell did you come from? Uh, leg. And he's got an automatic Glock. Ah, uh, yeah, this is connected to... What is this building? I uh, don't remember the name. Hub 360? I think it is. Anyhow... This is where we're going. <clears throat> of course it's not loaded. Ugh, this is frustrating. Oh, right. Oh, that's just to the roof, though. This building, I always thought was funny. Because, uh... If you look at it from here... It looks like a face, right? Like, <laughs> there's the eyes mouth. I call it the surprise building. Surprise face building. Alright, well, in we go. This one connects to uh, several different places, as far as I remember. It's one of the few skyscrapers where it actually tells you what floor you're on. There's not a ton of interest in here. When I had that mod I made a long time ago that added extra power armor suits to find, one of them was up here in this room. We'll look around while we're here. I do have at least three caches to get, so I don't want to take too long, but... I don't believe there's any explanation as to what this building was or anything like that. <clears throat> Some offices, I guess. Anyhow, took the elevator down. Gunners and mutants going out in here. Uh, let's get the Val out and just use the rest of my ammo so I can drop this guy. Ooh. Oh. Now that's a good one. I'm going to have to keep that. Miscellaneous stuff. I'm not gonna spend too. Ooh, I'll take that though. At these. Don't know what this this building was all about. Maybe they manufactured industrial parts or something like that. I don't know. Just spitballing.
I take the Glock 20, but honestly, it's not that. It's not very good. I think the 10 millimeter pistol is more effective. You can make it automatic, which is fun, but and you've got a Beretta. So that's it for this floor. I believe this is the part. Yeah, I think this is this just a blocked off sky bridge, and this leads to another building here. Place, wrong time, Gunner. <laughs> Brutal. Let's see what's through here. I know the cache is over there. I'm just, just looking. Skull in the toilet. Okay. That leads outside, so let's leave that for now. Here we are. Just get close and it opens up. Now they tell you that people are going to come take the stuff, but what's in here is not... You know what? I'm going to take that. <laughs> it's not that impressive, so I would assume it's something else that we don't know about that they're here for, because that really doesn't seem like enough stuff to uh, justify sending an operative here to open it up. Nice. Yep. We're hot. Ah, the gunners. Alright, that's all for here. Uh what am I missing here? What's this? Both led to the same place, apparently. Uh, to caliber ammo. Alright. Uh, let's check that door that goes outside. Or was it? I don't remember where this leads. And uh, it's raining. That's really gonna help my Boston frame rate. I'm recording higher now, but it was the reasons like this where I didn't want to for so long. Because it does not run well in Boston. I don't care what rig you're running. At least not on high graphics, it doesn't. Okay. Oh, I am getting killed. What the? How rude. Rip that gun. Raider. The strange little sub overpass things. I'm never gonna hit him in my. There we go. Ah, oh, crap. FPS is not helping me at all. Just die! Alright. Okay, we can get down here. We have a rebel ramp leading up to this building. Let's check this out while we're here. And if, unless we fall, that would be good. Oh yeah, this gutted building. Okay, I think I need to... I turn the rain off, but honestly I'm not sure it's actually gonna help. The frame rate, it's never good here. You can see... It's actually all. A lot of these buildings are connected. Uh, let's go back around the back here. See if we're missing anything. Yeah, this goes around, leading back to the overpass. And these two are connected. Okay. This isn't really a part of my mission. I'm just curious. I mean, I've seen all this before. Just. Things like this I like to find. Let's 
bottle caps. Someone died up here. Not sure what he was doing up here or how he didn't get crushed. This thing collapsed. Empty filing cabinets. <clears throat> so, for some context, the building, I think it's the one behind it, this one I'm looking at there, which is the Commonwealth Bank, is the one we started in. <clears throat> and yeah. So, it's quite the little jungle gym thing. This is the building I was thinking of. I think. With the power armor up top. I think that's the one. Won't be able to tell unless I see it from the ground floor. And then we go to this other strange round one. Never know what you're gonna find. <laughs> Turret. Alright. Well, let's go up here then. Hold on, this is a really cool screenshot. Alright. Might as well check out this place out since we're here. Convenient ramps. There's my building. This is the one I want my player home in. If I could ever figure out how to use the creation kit as good as I used to be able to use the GEC, or have the will to spend the time, maybe I'd do it. Damn it. Reminds me of playing on an old computer, on my old computer. I'm trying to hit things with iron sights with a bad frame rate. So this leads to where is this? Uh, this is this building? Oh, this is the Atlantic offices. This is the cut content building. I'll check that out some other time when I go. Uh, I'll go check out, show you the one in the glowing sea first. But this is the it was cut content that someone restored. So I do want to check that out sometime. But we got the DIA cache. So enough skyscraper crawling. Let's go back. She should have another... I say she. The robot should have another cash for us right away. Should. Um. What the hell? Let me reload. What the hell's going on here? Commencing recurrence analysis Oops. using the Brovian method. You can Current send a runner to the DIA complete. cache. Reward dispensed. Future tasks may be assigned. Okay, so I might have to leave and come back to get the next DIA, DIA cache. I would like to get them all in the same video. Uh, Processing. Agent. Professor. Your arrival was not calculated. What do you mean it wasn't calculated? Temporarily unable to process verbal input. Still processing. Preliminary adjustments to statistical models complete. Commencing introduction. I was, am, and will most likely be, Pam. Predictive analytic machine. Well, nice to meet you, Pam. Introductory token recognized. Nice to meet you, too. Unknown entity, I provide first order approximations of the behaviors of all residents of the region designated commonwealth rephrasing i predict the future what that's amazing caution biological life forms behave erratically unpredictably 
all output subject to an extremely high margin of error. Even if you're wrong sometimes, that's unbelievable. Repeat. Caution. Reliance on this unit's predictions is deemed unwise. Operation complete. You are a rogue variable. No current or previous models predict your presence or existence. Query. What is your point of origin? I'm from Vault 111, if that's what you mean. Accessing Vault 111. Cryo Vault. Believed destroyed. Conversation terminated. Pending construction of new probability matrix. Rephrasing. Goodbye. I'm not sure why I got that dialogue here. I'm just trying to get another cash mission from you. Pam. Analyzing. Okay, I'm gonna have to like leave and come back, so I'll cut until I get the next uh, cash mission popping up. So there's actually an interesting story on where Pam comes from. If I think you can read about it on the uh, terminals in the switchboard. I can't remember if I actually read it or not, but uh, if you want to know. Greetings. Data model indicates a 93% chance of another DIA cache being available for exploitation. I can recover it. Location of cache being transmitted to your Pip-Boy. Conversation terminated. Alright, uh, the Medford Memorial Hospital. What a fun place. I'm not sure if I've been through there yet. But it is not a fun place. Ah, oh, it's in Malden. Right, I was going to go to Malden and explore Malden. Oh well, we can still explore it sometime. I'm just gonna hurry in there and grab the cash. Can't remember if it's this hospital or... Pretty sure it's this hospital that's a little bit confusing. All right, here we are. Oh, and there's mutants, of course. I don't think this is the hospital I was thinking about. Pretty sure there's a. S oh, they hadn't spawned in yet. That's nice. We got fun time incoming. Damn it. All right. Gonna mess around too much. We're just gonna get into the hospital. I'm gonna leave exploring Malden for some other time. I would like to find the purpose of behind that hollow tape, that pledge hollow tape I found uh, a few episodes ago in the uh, Malden sewers or whatever. Ah, uh, this place, right? We need to use some pistol ammo. Starting to run low on the other stuff. Yes, this place. I'm not going to do a full sweep of this because it's a little complicated to explore the whole thing. I'm just going to, um, I not die. I'm just going to go for the cash here. Okay, I immediately regret. Yeah, there we go. So it's up above. One floor up. So. I can't remember what other quests are involved with this place, but. I know it's one of those places where bad guys like to respawn. What's going on? Up we go. It's actually up the third floor. Just get this cash and get out of here. Come on now. Yeah, I'll leave that for now. 
Let's get rid of these mutants. Oh. Alright, let's get this cash. Alright, so there's still boy. Miscellaneous stuff. Laser pistol. Not a lot else. Pre war money. Alright, just go get these mutants. with the extended mag is pretty good it's not automatic either it's just semi but it's still pretty good all right let's not stay here any longer than we have to you want to explore this place in full at some point but I might uh, save it for when I do Malden Right. I secure the DIA cash for you. Human interface. Well done, agent. Runners will be sent to acquire contents. Reward dispensed. All right. So like last time, I'm gonna have to travel away and uh, wait a little while. And uh, when I come back, there should be another cash for me. What is it they keep giving me? Why do they keep giving me covert sweater vests? I never got that. What's the level up first? Oh, these are good. I get... Yeah, this is a good one, but... It doesn't really... Help that much unless you're better at sneaking. I know, as my character is going to be kind of all over the place with its stats. Just because, uh... I'm going to be getting to a high enough level where I can get a lot of things basically maxed. That's the plan. Anyways, I'll see you back here as soon as there's a mission for me. In between missions as I, I travel back here, I figured I'd show you uh, one of the new paint jobs I got for the power armors. The uh, This is my only... <coughs> Whoa, excuse me. This is my only fully upgraded suit of power armor. This is the one I took into the glowing sea and I've, I've fixed it up since then. As you can see, and I got the Rally's Rangers paint from Fallout 3, which I thought was pretty cool. Anyways, I'll see you back at uh, the railroad. Pam. All processes are busy. Damn it. Ah, okay, I guess I'm gonna have to travel again. Yeah, didn't wait long enough. And when I approaches probability bounds. Pam. Recalibrating using new data set. Commencing recurrence analysis. Ah, using I waited an entire 24 hours too. I know that there's another cache. Mm. Okay. Guess I'll have to wait longer. I'm wondering if I need to talk to Tom first. The cash you found has some real serious high tech. But the creme de la creme is ballistic polymer weave. Uh -huh. Lightweight, serious stopping power. And it looks just like normal clothing. I got some in stock now. But, oh, give me some time. I got all sorts of ideas. Let's take a look. Okay, here's what I got. And so you can see that these are armored, actually. So those are ballistic weaved. But now I can make ballistic weave myself. Why does he have nine millis still? You know what? Let's let's get these. I don't think I've actually kitted out the deliverer because I haven't been using it. Uh, any other ammo I need here? I'll take that. Fusion core. Don't really need that though. Okay. Anyhow, maybe now Pam will. Damn it, Deacon. Maybe now Pam will give me the other cash. I'm ninety percent sure that there's three. Heads up. Tom's got more goodies in stock. Check with him. Pam. All processes are busy. Son of a bitch. Okay, I guess I'm gonna have to go check. Damn it, Deacon. Come on, man. Maybe now I have to leave and come back. I'm gonna go check, though. So, just a sec.
Okay, there is three, so there's one more I need to do. So maybe now that I got the Ballistic Weave, I should leave and wait. I'm getting really sick of doing this, but hey, let's go travel somewhere further. Alright, so I'm still trying to get the DIA cache mission, which um, I actually recorded the next episode, hoping that uh, it would advance enough so that I could get the last DIA cache, but now there's something else going on here, so let's see. Calculating. Institute presence increases odds of detection of all northern routes by 52%. 52%. That's prohibitively dangerous. Professor, how do you feel about getting thrown back into the fire? I'm on a first name basis with fire. You're in the right line of work then. We've hit a snag with Dr. Amari. You've dealt with her before but you may not know of the vital role she plays in our organization. Synths are supposed to go to the memory den. The doctor gives them a new set of memories, then they move out. But her latest patient is stuck there. The runner's route has been compromised and we're looking for options. Well, tell me about the options. We're trying to come up with another route that leads to the proper destination. Maybe, Pam, what if we reroute through Lexington? The switchboard is a nexus of institute activity. Odds of detection increase exponentially with proximity to the Nexus. In English, Pam. She means we can't run ops anywhere remotely near switchboard. The Gen 1s blocking the original route have to go. Gonna have to agree with Carrington here. I think the doctor's right. You see? Even he agrees with me. Enough. We do it your way then. Go to Dr. Amari and tell her rerouting isn't possible. You're there to clear the route for one last run. There's a lot at stake here, so get the job done. Okay. Very busy. Unless you need my medical so that's a bit of a side thing. These episodes have gotten a little mixed up, but I really want to do uh, all the DIA caches in one video, so maybe Pam's got one for me. Pam. Recalibrate using new data set. What? 